Hey, what's up guys? Insane Drummer. So today I wanted to test uh, the EMAD, which is the head that I have been having on this uh, Mapex Saturn bass drum, and uh, replace it with um, the Super Kick 2 from Aquarian. Um, you know, the Super, Quick, the Super Kick 2 is a legendary head. Uh, everybody knows about it's famous for its punchiness, and uh, that's what I like most about my bass drum heads. So uh, that's one reason I wanted to change it out. Um, the other reason is I just wanted to test uh, what the Superkick 2 versus the EMAD really uh, the difference sounds like. So let's check that out. This is the EMAD. Here's the Super Kick 2. Yeah, I definitely like the Super Kick better, uh, the Super Kick 2. Um, the Super Kick 2 works better for rock, it works better for metal, um, any kind of situation, you know, R&B, it really works better for any kind of, when you need that real thuddy bass sound, and that's what I love, I mean, I'm not going to lie, that's what I love. I think the EMAD 2 works better, I would say it works better for jazz, it works better for more of a warm bass drum sound, it's more of a, um, you know, I would say it's more musical than the Super Kick 2. But in the end, uh, in the end, at the end of the day, you know, what do you need out of your bass drum? Just like, what do you need out of your snare? You need something that has a lot of pop, pow, and some nice resonance to it. In the end, with your bass drum, you really need something that thuds, boom, and has a nice kick to it. And there's a the Super Kick 2. So, uh, I'm definitely a Super Kick 2 fan. Um, I tried out the EMAD for a while just just to try it out to see what it was uh, about. But, uh, you know, if I have another kit uh, around eventually, I'll probably put it on another kit eventually. But for my main kit, this Mapex Saturn, um, it's Super Kick 2 all the way.